Hey, what's up guys? So I finally finished upgrading my Mac Mini. Yes, it took me a while, but I finally got the last piece of the puzzle, which is the SSD. I was a little confused on which SSD to buy because there's so many different brands, there's so many different speeds, but ultimately I decided to go with the Samsung 840 Pro, which I believe is one of the best and one of the fastest and one of the most reliable according to reviews. And obviously for a Mac Mini, in order to have dual hard drives, you do need an extra adapter. And I did buy that adapter, so I installed. So now I have two hard drives inside of my Mac Mini. And now having the SSD as my main drive, that enables the computer system to boot up from a dead cold start and relatively fast. So I'm pretty satisfied with the boot up speeds. Again, I don't normally shut down my computer. My computer is literally on almost every single day, but it is kind of convenient to know that my system will be able to boot up in a short time. And if I need to restart the system, it can do it really fast. And also having an SSD means that opening applications is basically instant. Everything is as, as instant as possible. And even launching Final Cut, which is a real, relatively big program, it takes about three to four seconds, which is a huge difference. But again, the main reason why I got the SSD is for the raw performance. And the application that I use the most when pushing my computer to the limits is Final Cut. And, and I can tell you right away that there is a noticeable difference. Being able to edit, scrub through the video, and everything is just smooth. And when you're creating and being creative in terms of video, it's really nice to have the system keep up with you because it's kind of a shame when you're, you want to do something, you have this idea in your mind and you try to do it, but then the system bottlenecks and it holds you back. Also, as you guys can see, the performance here, you guys will see the read speeds and write speeds. The write speeds are topping at mid 300s, and I was honestly satisfied with that because what I really cared about was the read speeds. The read speeds are pretty high, and that's what gives you that sensation of speed. That's what makes the computer feel like new, and that's one of the main reasons why people are upgrading to SSDs is because of the read speeds. And now, my Mac Mini is now complete. It has a 2.7 gigahertz Core i7, 16 gigs of RAM, an SSD, and I'm pretty satisfied. I think that this system is going to be with me for the next couple of years, and I really don't see myself upgrading for maybe the next two and a half years, maybe until they, they come out with a, a 8 core Mac Mini or something, something where the, the performance difference is huge. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you guys are interested in the SSD, I'll have links down below in the description bar. And if you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up and I will definitely catch you guys next time.